Hello everyone, welcome back to my tutorial series on WooCommerce discounts. In this video, we're going to learn how to provide discounts for variable products. All right, we might have seen in a previous video how to offer discount for a specific simple product. But in this video, we're going to learn how to offer discount for a specific variable product. Well, we're going to use the popular WooCommerce discount plugin called Discount Rules Pro for WooCommerce to create such discounts. Before we get into the video, please make sure you have downloaded, installed and activated the Discount Rules Pro plugin on your site. If you haven't done this yet, then please do not worry because we have a video that can help you to install the Discount Rules plugin which we have posted already. You can find the link to download the plugin as well as the tutorial video in the description below. Feel free to check the description below for further details. With that being said, let's get started. We will have to go to the WordPress dashboard to WooCommerce. Under WooCommerce, you will find Wood Discount Rules to create this discount and click on Add New Rule to create a fresh rule. As discussed, we're going to offer discount on a specific variable product. Okay, so I'm going to offer 20% off on this variable product called V-neck T-shirt. Okay, nice. I have entered the rule title here. Now all that I have to do is select discount type by clicking on this drop down. The discount type that I'm going to select is a product adjustment discount type. Now it's time for us to select the product that is eligible for this 20% off. As I said, it's going to be a variable product. So click on this drop down and select products and list the variable product here. Okay, you can select one or more products as your convenience, but right now I'm just going for one specific variable product, which is V neck t shirt. Okay, so let me search for it here v neck t-shirt yes now you can notice that i have enlisted the parent product okay if i include the parent product here all the variants inside the parent product will also be eligible for the 20 percent discount okay so maybe in the later part of the video i will show you what happens if we only select specific variants inside the parent product all right nice for now let's just select the whole parent product itself nice and then percentage discount I'm gonna set 20% that is all now all that I have to do is save and close this particular rule and show you how it works remember I have added the parent product now let's go to the storefront to test this rule well I'm on the storefront and if I just go down to the variable product that is v-neck t-shirt I'm able to see that this particular v-neck t-shirt is eligible for the discount all right so let me go show you what happens now you can see that this variable product has two options the first one is color and size so I will have to choose it I'm going to choose the color to be blue and then size to be large okay now since I have mentioned the parrot product in the rule you will see no matter what color or whatever size I choose, I'll be still qualified for the discount. Okay, so let me add blue large to my cart. Also, I'm going to select a different color for our better understanding. This time green, medium, add it to the cart. And another product, red, small and add it to the cart. I'm going to take you to the cart page and here you can see all of the variants receive a 20% off isn't it why let me take you back to the rules and here you'll be able to see that I have enlisted the parent product so if you enlist the parent variable product here you'll be able to see that all variants inside the parent product will still qualify for the discount which is 20% off according to our scenario nice now let me show you what happens if we enlist a specific variant here instead of the parent product. I'm going to remove this parent product. Okay, now instead of the parent product, I'm going to add a specific variant. Okay, let's say green this time. Okay, so I have enlisted the specific variant green. Okay, now I'm going to save and close the rule. Take you back to my card page, refresh it and show you that the discount will be applied only on green because I have enlisted the specific green variant here instead of the parent product. I thought this will help us understand the difference between enlisting the parent product and a specific variant inside the parent product. 
Okay, thank you so much for watching. Hope this was helpful.